honored to be here again with Galvin's my name. I'm out of Lexington, Kentucky. I'm a criminal defense attorney down there. I've been at a change in the marijuana laws longer than a lot of you folks have been alive. <laughs> so, uh, you know, I, it's very nice to see your generation take this up as an iconic issue that it really is. The concept of, of America is based on trying to preserve that individual right to sovereignty. The election this fall in Kentucky is a, a microcosm of that entire battle. The Kentucky's broke and desperate and undereducated and obese and in his health. I'm running this year as an independent for governor. My running mate is D. Riley. She is the only woman in the race. I, of course, got Democrat opponents. We have Republican opponents. And we, of course, independent. No party affiliation whatsoever. We believe that the parties are the problem. They got their horns locked up. They're unable to take care of the people. And we believe an independent governor who does not care who gets credit for doing what's right for the people. There's only three governor's races in the United States of America this year, and we are one of them. And the big money is scared to death of us. We're already showing well in the polls. I just have kicked their ass three times on the stage now. Just got back this last Saturday and just obliterated the sitting governor. We'll be the most independent of any ticket elected to that office in 100 years since in the United States of America. And we're going to stand on human rights, individual rights, not just marijuana. Although that's the most iconic of individual rights. And that's what I've been standing on all this time. <clears throat> you know, this is a, it's not just marijuana because I like to smoke it. Not just marijuana because it's great medicine. Not just marijuana because it saves people's lives. But it is a seed that we can put in God's earth and continue to bring natural plants that comes up out of it. When you stop us from doing that, that's pretty well severing our relationship with the natural cycle of things that's certainly a direct assault on our sovereign humanity. So that's who we are and running with. This November is the race. We need money, we need support. So uh, you can go to gatewood.com, encourage your friends to go to gatewood.com. You can make online contributions, you can network your people, or you can get on your Facebook and let people know what's going on. But this is the most important election in the country this year, bar none. And if we win it, it's going to set the whole political world on its ear because we're going to win with probably less than 300,000 bucks against four or five million. And it's going to open up everything for the independent tickets around the country. So um, and that's, that's who I am. I tell folks I end my speeches down in Carlton, down in Lexington. In Kentucky, when I say, look, you all can believe what I'm telling you, because if I was going to lie to you, I would already have been elected governor. <laughs> yeah, Gatewood did mention this speech, guys.